My name is Bree. I love your dress. Thank you. <laughs> um, so can you tell me, what was it like working on Sprung? Um, it was incredible. It was so much fun. It was my uh, first TV job, so um, everything was new to me, and yeah. How did you get involved? Uh, just my managers got the audition, and I sent in a self-tape, and yeah, the rest is history. <laughs> Um, for you, working on your first TV job, um, what drew you to the script? Was there anything about it that's really stood out to you and you were like, I have to be part of this? Yes, I love that Greg creates people who are quote unquote characters, but they are also very real. And I'm a huge fan of characters myself. I love to like do them and come up with them. And so this was like a dream role for me. Yeah. And what was the most comedic moment on set for you? The most, sorry, what? Comedic. Um, <laughs> that's a good question. Oh, is there any pranksters on set who are always tricking people? Um, not so much, but at the end of shooting, I did prank Garrett Dillahunt. I bought him a gift that looked like a sleeping hood, but it was just an empty box, and he totally thought it was a real thing. That was a highlight, for sure. And what sort of audiences do you think will love the series? Oh, I think so many people can connect to it. I think it's cathartic and feel good and it's an easy laugh. Like everybody can laugh at a fart, for example, you know? So it's a wide range and I think everybody's gonna love it. And how do you think you got through the pandemic yourself? Was comedy a big part of that for you? Definitely. Um, being creative and making like little videos and dancing and things like that definitely got me through. Yeah. Welcome to Fab TV. Look at Hollywood's latest. See all the red carpets dressed to a T. Yeah, you know me. It's all free.